All right, so back over here, looking at the Ranchero. This is, uh, well, I got it out of a barn, but it was a more of a garage than anything. So, 351 Cleveland. It's got, definitely got a radiator issue. And you can see it's, it's going to need some gaskets and whatnot. But you can see all the stuff in there. And I think this one's just the two barrel. Let's look at the small air intake. Power steering, manual brakes, which I might convert that over. Uh, it does have brakes, but I may just convert it to power. Hi, baby girl. Yeah. She's here helping to inspect. Let's see what you got down in here. And it's got some antifreeze in it. That's all pretty much original. Of course, it'll need a battery, and they, they were smart when they parked it, that they uh, they took it, uh, the battery out. It looks like it's got a smog pump belt. Yeah, see that smog pump's locked up, so that's not going to run. You going to inspect it? Let's look inside the carburetor a second. Must have had a sticker on it, but it's fallen off. <laughs> yep, just a little old two barrel. Now we're gonna need to do a a, a uh, will it start video on this too? You can see it's definitely gonna need some gaskets. And I think it's got an FMX in it, if I'm not mistaken. And basically, this thing's a Torino. I would almost feel like it's more of a two door station wagon type chassis, but. Got a couple little chingers in the paint. I don't know. I've been thinking about putting a Bronco chassis underneath it. All this stuff's really in pretty good shape. That's going to need some work. Yep, 1993. I don't know what the windshield's out of. They think it was a, either Studebaker or Packard. They're not sure. Of course, it's got the original dog dish hubcaps on it. And beauty rings. Looks like the deer have been back here. Looks like that one's been sick. Looks like they got a, I don't know, maybe it blew a freeze plug out or something. That's an oil drain plug deal there. I don't know what that thing is. I'm afraid to find out. Looks like the windshield's got some trim that's coming off. This paint, this is literally the same color as my old 
70 Ford pickup, which was my dad's pickup. And I got it running last year and parked it there and the tire went flat. Anyway, I'm going to uh, I'm going to just ship this video off to you right quick just so you kind of see what we're looking at here and then I'm going to do a, a will it start on it at some point and we will see you next time thumbs up thank you for watching and we'll see you on the next one